We got an update to a chilling double murder. A daughter convicted of shooting her mom and her sister to death in their mom's McLean home for money and jealousy. But today, a Fairfax County judge tossed out Megan Hargan's conviction. And Bruce Lachan explains why. Juror misconduct is the allegation. One of the 12 jurors who convicted Megan Hargan just months ago allegedly went home and conducted her own experiment to see if this was double murder or murder-suicide, as the defense was arguing. Hargan, charged with killing her mother and sister, had an unusual defense, that her sister killed her mom and then killed herself, pulling the trigger with her toe. Juror Tasha Nix allegedly took her own rifle, held it with one hand, and put it on the top of her head to see if she could pull the trigger with her toe. She concluded that it was impossible and allegedly told her fellow jurors during deliberations that the defense theory was wrong. There were two bodies that were located. When they first arrived at the Hargan's McLean home in 2017, police also thought it might be murder-suicide. But detectives eventually concluded that Megan Hargan killed her mother Pam out of jealousy because she was buying a home for her sister, <laughs> Helen, but refused to transfer $400,000 to Megan's account so she could buy a home too. They too concluded it was absurd to think that Helen had killed her mother with a rifle and then used her toe to shoot herself in the top of the head and have the bullet travel down into her neck. Magic, it just isn't possible. Juror Tasha Nix has so far not returned our phone calls. Prosecutor Steve Descano says he is disappointed that the jurors' inappropriate actions have led the judge to throw out the case, but he says he is committed to getting justice for the victims and is preparing to retry Megan Hargan in the killing of her mother and her sister. At the Fairfax Courthouse, Bruce Lachan, WUSA 9.